Yo, Kev, can you, uh, where are we? Discord. What's a good camera for this? Uh, uh, this one? Can you imagine for an hour today, if we dig a hole in the ground that's shaped just like this, right? And then we, say this is a perfect dome, right? We cut the hole in the ground. We line that hole, we use it as a mold, and we make you a house 30 feet in diameter, 15 feet high, oculus in top, in the top, um, and it's like a beaver, right? It's completely solid fucking house, except for up here you have the oculus, that's your hole. Can you think of how you would modify this, right? Because this thing would be cheap as fuck. It would be a hybrid concrete dome over an identical dome in the ground because we cut the we cut the hole before we mold the top and then it just rotates like this right um th there's a ring there the whole time that's used to guide the cutting in the ground you can make this and then because it's so fucking perfectly symmetrical with really nice tools that you have in the community people can design shit and cut out fucking windows when they get like save up money get a huge fucking gorgeous window in the meantime, they put up four screens for Edward Murphy beds, which are like Murphy beds, right? Except for they fold down this way. So you got white, huge TV, huge TV, north, south, east, west, huge TV, huge TV. They all fold down to form beds. You can't watch when you're in bed unless you're the only one there. Like These are for like single dads, dad with up to three kids visiting. Um, the beds will come down. They will, they will be TVs, giant monitors. They will fold down to form beds, the bed part will fold up, and there'll be a crazy workbench, like, this, and four 16K monitors, or this, and the whole inside is a silver screen, and you simply wear old school 3D glasses, but new school, super light, super beautiful, and, and as you turn, the projector just above you projects that reality onto the totally smooth interior walls of your space. Up in the ceiling, in the space where the Oculus is, there will be like a, a, a six axis robotic arm that can get anything that you have in the house from I don't know, I'm tired. This this is a house, 10 grand, strong as fuck, nothing can fuck with it. A couple grand to dig the hole in the ground, uh, monolithic, strong as fuck. Reasonably sized, Oculus on top, on top, and like the Oculus can close like an app, like 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 a flower inward, um, and seal it off. And then when the weather's nice, it can open up and actually create kind of like a deck that's bigger than this, with springboards all the way around, so you can dive into your moat. Um, I, when it comes to puns, I'm the Pope. I'm the not the Pontiff, the Pontiff. I'm not a front man, I'm a front man. A frontery, a frontera. I gotta go poop. So, think about that, will you? Not the pooping. The completely monolithic. And if we're building universities, Kev, if we're building universities, we can build, you know the machine that carries the space shuttle? We can build printing crawlers that will do fucking everything. And maybe the best way to build your city which might be good in the case of Armageddon, is to build uh, a single $100,000 home office studio shop. Like, now, one at a time. Just in design. 